A local newspaper is reaching out to young Fort Wayne writers and highlighting their exceptional work. Tonight on Kids Who Care, Fox 55's Drew Fry lets us hear from these award-winning young writers as they answer questions about education and technology. It's a question community leaders still struggle with today. Should cell phones be allowed in schools? So the Fort Wayne Ink Spot newspaper is asking those directly affected. I wrote that phones shouldn't be allowed at school. I picked the statement no, that phones should not be allowed in school. And I think I picked that because I've just seen phones be used in a bad way in school. Uh, I wrote that th cell phones should be allowed in school because it, it can bring a new way of learning and maybe a new look on how cell phones are used in the community and in school. Virgil, Anaya, and Thonzen are your 2023 Ink Spot Essay Contest winners. Their reactions to hearing they placed in the top three. I'm going to be proud of myself and the hard work that I put into it. I was pretty proud of myself. Like, I did not know I would get this far. Very proud of myself and proud uh, that I actually did this and stepped out of my comfort zone. Many of these young writers didn't expect to be here, earning this sort of praise for their essays. You are behind the to be whatever it is that you want to be. This is kind of new to me. This is like one of my first times ever writing something like big like this. It was pretty scary at first, but um, getting used to it, like, it comes over time. But they're inspired to learn that there are adults who are listening to what they have to say. I think it's cool knowing that people are looking at me and seeing what I'm doing good. It was pretty good knowing that people actually care and are, are willing to change how they look at uh, I like different uh, mindsets. And they all plan to continue writing for themselves and others for years to come. In Fort Wayne, I'm Drew Fry, Fox 55 News. This is Ink Spot's third annual essay contest for Fort Wayne youth. The newspaper wants to show kids that their experiences and their opinions are worth sharing.